Hi everyone, Emma here. I'm so excited to show you these lovely earrings. So these are chandelier style earrings and they are super simple to make and I'm going to show you how to do it. I will put the links to these chandeliers because I did have a hard time finding them. I bought them about three years ago but I did manage to find the link and these lovely pinch bales. I'll leave the link for that too and I'll put the link for the crystals. Um, I just did an unboxing of these crystals not, maybe a month or six weeks ago and I mentioned that I would be ordering all the colors so let's talk about that quickly and then we'll get to the earrings. So I did order all the colors that I didn't initially order because they were so amazing. So let's just quickly take a look at the different colors. So there you go. You could see how amazing these are. They are so beautiful. Let's take a turquoise one out. They are lovely. Now I did mention when I did the initial unboxing that they aren't um, exactly perfect. Some of the holes are not lined up side to side. So for instance, this one's a little off to the side. Some of them were a little worse than the others, but these are super cheap, so it's not a big deal. I'm just noticing I found a cracked one at the hole. But again, if you're using this for uh, with a pinch bale, you wouldn't see that crack, but I might just put that aside anyway. So yeah, these are, they're so lovely. Look at that. They're gorgeous really really nice so let me see I think this one yeah you can see how crooked that hole is there's the hole it's quite a bit crooked but once you put it on a pinch bell you don't notice it so we'll put those aside and I will add the link for those so I did use the turquoise ones um, I'm laughing because Normally when I do earrings, I'll make one earring and then show you how to do the other one. And I went to make these and I had already put the two of them together. Don't ask me. I don't remember when I did that. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to make a set of gold ones. So I will go through and tell you what I use. So first of all, these, I just ordered these um, earring uh, hooks. They are super, super beautiful. They've got like the cubic zirconia crystals in there and everything. Um, yeah, I'll try and get the link for those because I, I didn't do an unboxing of these. And, and then, so you need one of these uh, chandeliers. You can use different types of chandeliers as well. And because these chandeliers, let me show you. So these come in silver, this like really... Um, yellowy orange gold and then it comes in the KC gold as well so you can order the different ones they're super super so because they have a hole in the middle and there's a little loop there you would assume you'd put something in there and um, that hole is so small that you have to be picky on what you put in so I did take a six millimeter pearl and added one of those um, it's like a I'll, I'll show you, they're like little bales that you glue in. Um, I would have liked to have a flat one to go on the bottom, like a little filigree type flat one, but I have, I don't have any of those, but you really, once it's on your ear, you don't notice the hole in the bottom. So it's put together with a four millimeter jump ring and you can see it actually passes the hole. Again, when you're wearing them, you're not going to notice that. Let me just hold it up so you can kind of see. So it's going to sit like that. And then you're going to need some 5 millimeter jump rings. I'm using 18 gauge. You can use whatever you have. You can put smaller or bigger jump rings as well. It's up to you. And then I have these lovely pinch bales. I will put the link to these pinch bales. They're uh, like uh, 100 of them for $2.30 Canadian. They're super cheap. And these are so beautiful. So let's take a look at the gold one. So for the gold one, I didn't have that orangey yellow gold earring, but these are the gold earring 
ear wires. I'm just showing you the side. They are really lovely. And I used a um, like a light gold pearl, a preciosa pearl. And that's what I used in the I yeah, the other I don't know if this is a preciosa. Yeah, I think it is six millimeter. And then these guys. So these guys come in the different color golds as well, the pinch bales. So let's go ahead and get started. So I went ahead and started on some of the pinch bales. Let me enlarge this. I think it might be easier to see. So there's your crystal and there's your pinch bale. Okay. So I put three of them together. So there is five loops at the bottom. So you're going to need the five crystals and your five pinch bales. Um, let's add the pearl. So let's talk about the pearl first. And let me show you. I'm not sure what they call those connectors. Pearl or bead end connectors. I'll try and look it up for you and put it in the description. They come in different sizes. And surprisingly enough, the smaller size was what worked for me. So... You know, I, I have bought some, like I do have the larger size, but um, I don't know. You'd really need a big bead for that. So this, I'm going to show you what I did. I already glued it onto the pearl and I did that because the glue I'm using is this, um, it's like Loctite. It's kind of like a crazy glue gel. So when you open this, you can squeeze this and one drop will come up. It keeps its shape and I did find that it takes a little longer than uh, crazy glue to dry. Not much longer, but for the sake of a video, I want to make sure you see what I'm doing. Um, so you go ahead and glue your own. Um, just be careful not to put too much. I put like the tiniest drop in the hole and then I put this part onto the pearl and just set it down and let it dry. So we're going to take a four millimeter uh, jump ring to attach it because there's not a lot of space in there. So let's grab this and open it up. We have a little kitty joining us tonight. I'm surprised he's only tried to get on my desk once. He used to come in my office all the time and just sit there. It, there's a little shelf next to my desk. Like it's part of the desk. So I'm just putting the pearl on there. And then I'm going to hook it. I'm just looking at this. It looks a bit bent. Um, so yeah, he used to get up there and just sit there and listen to me when I'm doing videos and stuff. But... Lately, he wants to get on top of my desk. So I'm surprised today he didn't insist. Cats are so funny, eh? They have no clue. They'll walk across anything. Broken glass. I mean, I have needles everywhere and containers with my beads and yeah, it just walks right across. So this is a little bit kind of tight here. Let me see. I might try and just squeeze it together. Here, I think. This is how I did the other one. I need another one of these pliers. Do you think I could find where I ordered it from? I'm pretty sure it was Amazon, and I went ahead and ordered what I thought was these, but they were, the ends were actually round, so you can't grip it very well. The, um, the, the troubles of a princess, a bead princess, <laughs> as my wife would say. <laughs> so you can see it doesn't, like, it doesn't fit all the way through, but once you just kind of scooch it, it it'll go. So it's not a big deal. 
<laughs> that looks amazing. You know, I searched and searched for the perfect color. And I couldn't find it. And then I'm like, you know what? I need to go back to the Preciosa pearls. And that's what it is. Okay, so you're gonna we're gonna now attach the um or we're gonna finish the pinch bales. So these come sometimes they're they're set like that. Sometimes you know they're super wide open, sometimes they're closed like this. But they're super soft, so you can just, I take the, the pliers and stick it in between, and then I push a little bit with my uh, pliers to open it up. And I'm just going to straighten this guy a bit. It's uh, getting warm out, so everybody's out mowing their lawns. And of course, my allergies are really bad. Okay, so you can... You could probably squeeze this with your fingers and try and match the hole there. There, there. Didn't need. So this is what I was saying about the holes crooked. You see how the, the crystal's coming out that way? But you know what? It still moves. And when you put it on your earring, you're not going to notice. Even if you put it on that way, you're not going to notice. So no big. Let's do this one here. And yeah, so you can squeeze them with your fingers. Okay, so let's attach these. These are five millimeter 18 gauge jump rings. They're gold plated. I'm almost out of these and I thought I had ordered some more, but again, <laughs> the life of a princess. I have no idea. I can't remember if I actually ordered. I have th three orders pending from different places. And uh, so we're just going to, we went through the hole on that chandelier. Then we're going to add our, I'm just going to move this down a bit, add our uh, crystal there. Just hang on to that. And then with the other plier, and you're always, you know, gently twisting it towards each other, like that. And there's the first one, like that. And it's going to sit that way. So I love this little, like, bumpy design. It's very organic looking. So it's amazing those little pinch bales were super cheap. But I I've used them so much I just love them. You can also grab this, put that on your crystal, and then go for your loop and then dangle that. Grab the two ends and just Gently move them together, and there we go. Let's get the next one. Okay. So I have a few other videos. I'm not sure when these will be released. I am getting ready to have surgery on Tuesday, and today is Saturday evening. So I'm doing some of this stuff to just relax and have fun and not think about things. And I also wanted to clear off my desk. I had, I've had these on my desk for a while. So that looks good. Oh, I have a, um, a display for uh, bracelets on his shelf. He's now going to try and open the door. Let's see if he opens it. I am so blown away by this cat. The door was, it wasn't like clicked all the way closed, but it was closed enough that there was no gap between the door and the door frame. And he managed to open it with his paw. So it's pretty. He's funny. I watch him. If I'm in the bathroom, 
my wife's office is door is next to the bathroom so you, she'll have her door closed and he tries to go in there he headbutts the door and gets it open like kitty you're gonna get brain damage if you don't get it from the door you'll get it from your cat mommy for sneaking in We have started a routine. I um, showed my wife how to stream YouTube on the television. So now when we get up to have our coffee in the morning, she goes, okay, it's time for your cat video, Emma. So she <laughs> plays a cat video for me. Okay, I'm just looking at this one and the crystal is not dangling properly. So we probably have it too tight. So let me just open it a tick. And it will dangle. So there. Oh, these are lovely. I'm so excited. Okay, we need to open this, I think. I did notice these have a little, you can kind of see that little piece that sticks out. And I did notice because this is such a small hole that it was getting caught on it we'll test it first but i ended up taking my file and um just filing it down a bit we'll see if this one works so remember to put the front i mean actually it doesn't matter they're they're the same on both sides so it doesn't matter which way you go but just remember you have a front to your ear wire that looks fine. I don't think I'm going to need to sharp or file that one. And just straighten this out and close this. It's tight. Let me try it this way. There. And it's moving around nicely, so that's great. Oh, isn't that pretty? These are awesome. So I will put all the links. And if I forget something and you um, just have to know, let me know. And I'll uh, when my computer's on, I'll search for it. So let's take a look at the blue ones, the silver ones. It's hard to maneuver here. Let's just do it like this. Get these out. There. And then we have these. There. Enlarge that so you can see. There you go. So thank you for joining me. I hope you enjoyed that. And stay tuned for more videos. <laughs> Bye.